Understanding body language, a key to improve your listening skills. Hello everyone, welcome back to our English language learning series. Today, we're delving into an essential aspect of communication that goes beyond the words themselves. We're talking about body language. And more specifically, we will focus on how to interpret body language in context. Understanding this will not only improve your listening comprehension, but will also provide you with clues about the speaker's tone, attitude, and overall message. Body language, also known as nonverbal communication, is a type of communication that includes gestures, facial expressions, posture, and even eye movements. It's as important as the words we speak often conveying feelings and intentions that words might not fully express. So when you're listening to someone speak in English, paying attention to their body language can give you more context and a better understanding of their message. When trying to interpret body language, the context is key. What might seem like a sign of nervousness in one context could be a sign of excitement in another. For example, if someone is tapping their foot during a job interview, it might be due to nervousness. But if they're tapping their foot while listening to music, it could be a sign of enjoyment. Here are a few more examples of body language in context. 1. Crossed arms. This can mean that a person is defensive or closed off. But in a cold room, it might simply mean they are trying to keep warm. Two. Eye contact. In Western cultures, maintaining eye contact can show confidence and interest. However, in some cultures, excessive eye contact can be considered rude or confrontational. 3. Smiling. Generally, a smile is associated with happiness or friendliness. But sometimes, people smile to mask their true feelings. So, the key takeaway here is that the same gesture can have different meanings depending on the context. When you're listening to spoken English, it's not just about the words and grammar. Understanding the speaker's body language can help you grasp the nuances and subtleties of their message. It gives you clues about their attitude, their feelings, and their intentions, which can make your comprehension of their speech more accurate and complete. For example, if the speaker is discussing a serious topic but is smiling or laughing, it could suggest that they're using irony or sarcasm. This is something you might miss if you were only focusing on the words. And there we have it. Understanding body language in context is a powerful tool that can significantly improve your English listening skills. It's like having a second layer of communication at your disposal. As we've learned today, it's essential to consider the context when interpreting body language. So keep practicing and you'll get better and better at it. We hope this video has been helpful to you. Keep learning, keep exploring and you'll see your English language skills improve every day. See you in our next video. Happy learning!